today in Modern Living TV, we go beyond the usual haunts of lifestyle shows and enter the provocative realm of Paul Pfeiffer, a New York-based contemporary artist whose art is not only pretty to look at, but also something to think about. We're here at the College of St. Benilde's Museum of Contemporary Art and Design for his very first solo show in Asia, here in the Philippines, The Vitruvian Figure. From a massive gathering of local and international artists, we move to a one-man show. Internationally renowned and critically acclaimed multimedia artist Paul Pfeiffer visits the Philippines to bring us a compelling collection, which he calls Vitruvian Figure. I have a question. As a visual artist, I guess you're not like a traditional artist where you can possibly sell your work. You know, how, do, how does this work for you? There's a very small but very serious um, community mm -hmm. of patrons in the world who actually do collect this type of work. Really? Like installation art? Yeah. Installation art, video art. It's a very special kind of collector. Mm -hmm. um, and there's some key ones. With this line of work, it's it's really all about... It's very demanding. Yeah, and it's all about what what's in your head. You don't necessarily have to think about... Oh, well, you know, to me, it's, I mean, whether you're a painter or a chef or... Yeah. There's always a balance between, you know, your integrity and what you, what your vision is and mm -hmm. realizing it. And, and then the world yeah. that you live in and things you, there's always a dialogue with mm -hmm. society. To me, art is the most social possible what's your, endeavor. What is your goal as, as a visual artist? Like, what do you hope people come out, you know, come out of here and think about? In a way, it's like food. I want to innovate forms of pleasure, mm -hmm. tastes, combinations of flavors. And then, you know, I want to comment on society. I want to, like, materialize things that are in my head. To me, there's, like, the kinds of artwork that appeal to me are the ones that are both entertaining and pleasurable yeah. and also challenge me. The MLTV team also chanced upon Ye Ye Cruz, Director of the Museum of Contemporary Art and Design in Manila. You know, we were just talking earlier that the space lends itself to this kind of installation. So would be the, this the first of many installation type work? Uh, actually, we've been having quite a lot of them. This okay. is like the fifth. Oh, wow. Yeah. Uh, the last exhibition we had was on video, mm -hmm. and it was called uh, The Surface of the World, the Film and Architecture in the Moving Image. Yeah. It was, again, in a sense, uh, an installation, because it's very difficult to put up a fifth. Of course, a show of course, in, this in kind of space. Like yeah. What do you feel? Are we ready for it now? What is it? Is I there a burgeoning? I think we're ready for it, but I think we have to be a bit more ambitious into how we're actually going to do that mm -hmm. and be not to be afraid of what we're going to do yeah I mean we have to go outside of the walls yeah so we can't I, just be wall based it's such a um, honor to be able to walk through some of the pieces oh, yes. with him yeah, yeah, yeah. because as I was saying earlier it's such conceptual art but yeah. he's so approachable yeah, yeah, he's yeah. easy to talk to and yeah. really interesting and he actually wants your take on it yeah, yeah, which yeah. is it's not so much what he's trying to say but he wants to know what you take, you take from his art, yeah, which yeah, is yeah, it's true. Yeah, yeah. You know. And I think that's what every artist should be. Yeah. To be very generous with what their art speaks of. Mm. And I think that's what every every exhibition is. Yes. Yeah. Every time you have an exhibition, it's out there. Yeah. But the moment it's there, it's like a sentence that's been said, then you can't take it back. That's wonderful. Yeah. Thank you so, so much. What, what else can we expect from MCAD? How we do it is we have local exhibitions, we have uh, regional exhibitions and international shows. Yeah. And we've been doing that and I think we're pushing MCAD to new levels and just pushing it to become, in a sense, more institutional. But not in the sense that we Filipinos think, think of institutional. And as institutional. Yeah. Because MCAD is very young. It still has a room to grow and actually be at par with a lot of yeah. uh, museums elsewhere. Don't fail to catch Paul Pfeiffer's Vitruvian Figure exhibit at the College of St. Benil's Museum of Contemporary Art and Design. The exhibit runs until April 16, 2015.